You are I a agree. guest chair. Yo, no what's bottom. going on, guys? Welcome to another episode of the Jerks Podcast. I am your host, Mark Arsky, with my co-hosts, Danny Hamill and Dylan Mahler. We have Luis Alvaro. Is what's that how up? you say it? Your last name? Did I get it right? Alvaro? Arevalo. Yeah, I was right. Hey, <laughs> How you doing? Like, you were one of our first yeah, guests cool. in the beginning, man. Do you remember you just randomly came yeah, on? Yeah, 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 yeah. Because yeah. yeah, you guys were talking about, I don't know what you guys were talking about, but it was fun. I was like, I need to jump in. Hell and yeah. then that was the most fun. Oh, and like I was talking about earlier, it was funny because we go back to that episode. I think I was talking about going on a date <coughs> or talking getting about like some pussy. and then, about bombing in front of baddies. And then lady, like, uh, what's up? <laughs> <laughs> this isn't your girlfriend. Who's this? Oh, that's, that's definitely. That's, that's his definitely roommate. Wait, his hold, wait, hold on. Is this the person you brought on Saturday? Uh, <laughs> hey, listen, I don't listen. That's, that's his roommate. Uh, yeah. Oh well, I I don't care. They uh, live together. I don't have to deal with have this. Dinner uh, together and play I checkers. am in an open, committed, honest, open relationship, so I can say whatever I want. <laughs> so, speaking of the baddie, we were talking about this prior. Yes. Performing in front of baddies, in front of bad bitches. How do you guys? Oh. No, 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 no. Let's be more specific. We were talking about bombing in front of baddies. Okay, yeah, bombing. Because performing in front of bad women, obviously that's fun, that's exciting. You've, yeah, you've done but well, bombing right? in front of them is, is the worst to kind of depression. But it feels really good when you're <laughs> making them laugh. You're yeah. staring at them. You're like, I'm above you. Right now, <laughs> in, in regular talk, you'd be above me every time. Yeah, I'd be I mean, so agreeable. But right now, yeah, I could like, <laughs> That's a powerful feeling. I like how you're looking at me. It's like this conversation is wild. I don't you're know if it's above him, but I don't know above no, him. But it's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know with you, Mark. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> um. No, but, yeah, it, it hurts. It hurts extra to bomb in front of him. I just, I just stop looking at him after. <laughs> you know, like they're there. I'm this way. My body language is completely like. I just walk out the venue, right. yeah, because I can't. I'm just depressed now. Like I'm gonna go cry in the car. Well, you mm-hmm. just pretend they're not there. It happened the in Taylor wasn't. Street, dude. Just <laughs> oh, a yeah? group of hot girls. <laughs> I think I one remember of them got that. Dared to go up, and she just recited Shrek. Did oh, better than I did. Nice. Mm-hmm. Well, our friends so were there. I told her I was like, "This is the most amount of women I've ever been around." <laughs> Ever. You Especially shouldn't, you shouldn't tell people things and like that. Did she that. laugh? I think they laughed at that. That's but then good. after that, they were like, clearly. <laughs> Damn. Oh, last night at Sucks. Shakers, Khalil was up and. <laughs> oh, no. He went to. There's this couple sitting there. Did he go there. up consensually or no? I believe so. Oh, okay. I think he was allowed <laughs> this time. Yeah, it's weird. <laughs> that was ironic when Anthony posted that picture saying, Can you vouch for Khalil? He consented to this, or okay. <laughs> have to pile it on. The irony was <laughs> strong consented. in that post. The irony was so strong. It's like, don't worry, you get It's like, okay, well, that's the problem. Yes. The, that's the problem with Khalil. But uh, what's it called? I think he's. You know what's goofy. cool? I talk about bad women. It's also weird when they're heckling, and then you like, mm. he- and then you like put them in their place, but they're like so bad. They're like kind of above it. I, I don't know if you ever been in, a, in that situation I where you're doing crowd work. By a hot girl, yeah. I have. Like, yeah, you're like, mean like, to them, but you still want to fuck them. No, no. <laughs> and so, they love that. I was hosting a show one time, and then there was this baddie from from Canada, and oh. she was heckling. She was like heckling, and then I kind of was like going back and forth with her, and she was I was losing, but she was just so like it did not affect her. And then I talked to her after. And she was still like, no, I'm in the right. Like, I was just trying how to help long, you. How long did you and talk I was like, to her no. for? Trying to help you. Like a, you... like a minute. Like, because I was just so, one, one, because I was like, the show was still going on. So I was like, I have oh, to go okay. back. Was... But two, I was just like, kind of was like, so over her mm-hmm. at that point. It's just like, you know, when people just have bad attitudes, it doesn't matter. Like, you're just like, whatever. And a lot of bad bitches have terrible attitudes. Thanks, bro. Terror nice. the worst. You just give it to him. Nice. That's his boyfriend, man. Sorry. Say thank Dude, you. I looked at his cock like <laughs> I needed a water. But John was on the phone, <laughs> I so I didn't want didn't to bother him. So I had someone do a Did mission. You, buy the, you didn't buy these with the paint on there, right? No, nope, yeah, nope, I'm a painter. That's, that's a, pretty cool. Yeah. It's so you sick. work at a gay bar and you're a painter? Yep, yep. Let's check. Are you I'm a very a colorful. Are you wearing yep. a fun? Currently. Yes! Currently, no it's matches. warm outside. I, get so I feel like on when a guy just, wears a thong near me. It's so crazy. I hear thongs are comfortable. Yeah, They're, yeah. I'm like, as about long it. as you uh-huh. can find enough like room up front, those ones, you know. Me, well, the I'm good. Oh, trust me. <laughs> you can wear flat. it backwards. It's fine. <laughs> <laughs> dude, me on my motorcycle with a whale tail would be the best thing ever, dude. Guys would be beeping, and then they see my hairy back, and they'd be like, "Oh my god, dude." <laughs> <laughs> that would be disgusting. Yeah, no, you should draw the navy. That'd be an awesome picture. Do a photo shoot looking cool as fuck from the front and the back. Fong. Right. Mm-hmm. Hairy ass. Just like the everywhere. hairiest. Yeah. Plus, like, I don't, do you wear like boxer briefs? 
Because, like, the feeling of getting boxer briefs, like, bunched up, it's like getting caught in your bed sheets, you know? It's very uncomfortable. Mm -hmm. I feel like all of that is eliminated. Dude, my boxer briefs feel like my asshole is an endless deep hole because they just go so far. I can just hole. keep pulling. Wow. Like the magicians when they pull out the uh -huh. thing out of their mouth. I just, <laughs> it's so stuffed. Uh -huh. I'm so stuffed when I wake it's like up. space time, dude. <laughs> I'm so It's insane. No, we were talking like about, he's wearing one right now. Mm -hmm. Should I start wearing one? So what? When I'm she on wants the to bike, say something. <laughs> are, are, I bend over. I have a well, whale tail. We don't tail. have to ask her. You know she's wearing a thong. Moby Dick Either that or here. nothing. Honestly, like it would be irresponsible, irresponsible for her not to be wearing a thong. I think. Mm -hmm. well, what else really? Is, what is? It? See, oh, wait, that's wait. that's the right answer. <laughs> I don't wear Isn't anything that you else. UTI? That is dedication. That uh, you... Yeah, since ten, she said. Since ten. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> you didn't need to know Maybe that. a little early. Bulgari now we all feel Bulgari weird about Bulgari it. Bulgaria is different. <laughs> What's the legal yes, drinking age in uh, Bulgaria? Dude, I bet you beer wasn't considered an alcoholic beverage till 2010. <laughs> Just like Russia. <laughs> That's the clean liquid. <laughs> no, dude. In Russia, you could buy a beer as a soft drink. Oh yeah. As a kid, just a. Because it's not oh my alcohol. Gosh. Right. So That's like Coca-Cola's. <laughs> Damn. Co? Ne? That's it's amazing. Wild. You could just buy cocaine in a drink. Coca-Cola. Coca -Cola. It's still technically made with cocaine. Because that's how they get the flavors through the coca leaf. Mm. They filter, but it's not, you know. But it is. I'd really Cocaine's like to grow dope. that. You like, have you done it? Have you done blow? Oh, you would I've be, never tried you it. You would be insane. I would you be. You would be too, I feel much, like too much Danny. That's why I would. <laughs> I've never try tried it. I, I was like, I don't think. You're the type who tries it once fentanyl. You did. Dead. No, I'm the type that I'll I'll kind of. Oh my god. If I like it, you know, no, you I will like it. Then I, you know, it's not There's a good idea. There's nothing not to like. I saw but. this like video of people that were on fentanyl or whatever, and they're just right angles, like bent forward so far as like consistent. Like I don't really know that much about that. I'm not trying to like hate on them, but I just saw that like just a little glimpse of it. I was like, holy fuck. Yeah, and dude. It's like the yes, it's like next level heroin, right? Like I don't know. Isn't this hilarious? <laughs> it's not. Yeah, it's not funny. I no, still like the angle of the camera. It's all the way over there. We're just like looking at each other, hey. so it does not translate well no, on dude, screen. It's, it zooms in. <laughs> it zooms. It zooms in. Okay. Should we look at the camera more? I try to when I make a point. You know? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, like I'm trying. Women. It's weird. It's weird to try to talk to you guys, but like look at the camera at the same time. I don't know. It's kind of. Are feedback. we breaking the fourth wall by looking at the camera? Yeah. Is there? A f there's no, not even. Breaking the we don't really even have a wall. That wouldn't be breaking the fourth wall, really. I think breaking the fourth wall is like when, on YouTube because you're kind of supposed to look at the camera. It's like an added thing. Yeah. I mean, like, hey, stop what you're doing. Yes, you. I'm talking to you. Where do you, you think that started? You think it was like Jim in the office looking at the camera with no, his, his I guarantee face? No, I'm no, comic not. books. <laughs> oh, that they turn yeah, onto the page and they're like, stop oh, reading. Right. I never read Me comic book. But how do you loser? know that? Because I get. I don't know. This is just tropes. Yeah, it's just knowing the history of tropes. It doesn't have to be a narrative. Yeah, You're trying know. to be like tropes. a writer. How do I know that? What are some tropes? It sounds deep, right. Deep. Maybe I'm autistic. I'm pretty sure it started with you books are. and novels. Dude, people think I am. I'm pretty sure it started books and novels where they would break the fourth wall. Uh -huh. So what, what is that? What is a book? <laughs> It's Bible. like it's a tree sliced thin, mm -hmm. <laughs> really thin, like a loaf of bread, but yeah, thinner and with information. Yeah, mm -hmm. and you That's don't need it. it. Should we describe a paragraph now? <laughs> <laughs> what? How about the index? How to use one? You the wrote index. a book. There's no index PTSD in my book. Right now? You wrote a book. The only book is the yeah. I, wrote did a book. Write a book. I still mm -hmm. haven't haven't read. I have it though. Yeah, you haven't read any of it, huh? No, but the part where you. You throw this guy writes a book. <laughs> a ficus is so weird. Where you give head to a ficus. What? It's, Wait, a, plant, what? it's a plant sex story. He loves plants. No okay. wonder he's so happy. He clearly hasn't read any of it. <laughs> no, I don't remember you that part. Bitch. I, I believed him. I'm not going to lie. For a quick second, I believed you, you did write <laughs> about me choking, <laughs> choke <laughs> fucking a ficus. Giving fellatio I mean, that could be a fun is. poem. Right? Yeah, fellatio choke to fucking a ficus. Fellatio yeah, to a ficus. What's ficus to a fellatio? Pain. Uh, write it right, right now. Go for it. I just did. Yeah, some, yeah okay. That's a good, yeah. Like, so, so that's a question I wrote for this podcast. Do you think you guys could write like a good sex scene? 
Yes. A sex scene. I'm drowning like, in a tub. It, There's a shark. A porno. She's a milf. A lifeguard saves me, sucks my this cock. Character development. To res- resuscitate me. Yeah. I stole all of that. Yeah, I, was was say, yeah. I've s- I love that I one. I guess you could very... go anywhere with that. No, okay, yeah, let's direct our own porn. Okay. Um. Okay, we're at Josephine's. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> that was. Uh, it's a so, Friday, so people no, are actually so here. Mine's, it's, <laughs> we're at Josephine's. It's a Tuesday. She's Bulgarian. Okay. Huh? Huh? Now you can walk in front of the camera if you want. It's okay. I learned enough of the language to impress them. Go. 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 You just sound like. I have a Bulgarian flag under my shirt. I know. Yeah. 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 (laughs) She was like, "All right, (laughs) I'm I'm getting the fuck out." (laughs) Big Bulgaria buff. We scared the baddies away. So how's no, that? She's, she's great. Just, she loves racist jokes. <laughs> You're gonna love her. Um, what is your all make good country? eye contact, right? Where we make it. Check her eye contact in the comments below. <laughs> her eyes dip low. If you know what I'm saying. We're not. Whoa. Uh, watching the video we're talk, very much. We're just talking about you. I know. I heard you. Just you know. Well, she heard you. The sexual tension is, s- is so low. I don't. <laughs> <laughs> there is a violence, there is, there's nothing. It's so non existent. <laughs> she is so dry. We <laughs> all already jerked off today. <laughs> so I did it. Surprisingly, Wait, I, I have I didn't not. Either. Really? I didn't either. No, not. I don't yeah. know why oh, I didn't. Man. Are you, does that I'm mean trying, you're going to be I'm better or worse? I'm trying to cut back. Stand up. Uh-huh. You, you do it too often. I'm trying to cut I'm back on reading my It's not that I do it often, right but I think just like Dude, doing it less Vladimir. would benefit me. I've heard that's a whole movement. You stop doing that. Oh, uh, no, no, no. I'm not. Don't put me. Don't put me in those. Don't put me <laughs> in with sure those weirdos. Please do not group me in with the no fab losers. No, I don't. I, <laughs> oh, no. yeah. Do you guys think that? I feel like that's not healthy. I feel like once a day is good. You should. Yeah. I think it's helpful to do it, but the way they, like, try to, like, frame it and... To be fair, they have a problem. They should definitely stop. The way they talk about fappy, those people are addicted. They should definitely stop. But at the same time, it's like this weird dichotomy (laughs) because... But the way they talk about it, they should it. But the way they talk about it is, like, they should just to, like, not go crazy. You know what I'm saying? It's like this weird thing. Not overdo it. Just do it. I feel like like if you don't do it, then, of course, they're like that. (laughs) Yeah, exactly. Like the way they talk like about it is like you should it, but at the same time you should because you're clearly not right in the head, and you <laughs> you should fat because something is wild wrong with you. Yeah, because they might be criminally horny. Like they should jerk off mm-hmm. before they commit exactly. an offense. Exactly, that's what I'm saying. Right. Yes, like you are. Because women don't get criminally horny. Guys do. That is also like the weird thing, right? People want to talk about how porn is like this this bad thing, but <laughs> statistically, countries that don't have porn bans, like the sexual assault, is like. Probably like through the roof. Porns that are banned, yeah, like so sexual assault is high and shit, and shit like that. Damn. But uh wait, so like you I'm I'm guessing you guys have been watching porn for a long time. Haven't missed a day since nine. <laughs> <laughs> Every yeah. So like have you guys gotten to a point where like you have to get into the crazy stuff just to jack just I to get off? I jerked off to a real life hentai porn of a girl getting fucked by a mechanical squid. Ray Lil Black. What? <laughs> oh, Ray Lil Black is great. You gotta see this. She's one. amazing. You got dude, she's getting really into these. She has three of them. Mechanical squid it plays with it did. Send me the link. Okay. You know what? You know what pisses me off? Men don't share porn links enough like that as we should. That's why I go on Reddit to get my porn. Yes. It's just a bunch well, of horny it's guys. Free. Just because it's free. Yes, exactly. Because it's free. It's also and also because it's men be like, oh, you got to watch the, it. Yeah, here's you the gotta, best porn. Yeah. Right. And they yeah. curate it for you. And new people, they're like, yo, this is this is my new favorite porn star. Check her out. And, and it's always and good. Right, dude. Mm-hmm. They're all right. Oh, my God. <laughs> More like Reddit, that's the thing. Reddit follow? is only good for porn. Reddit like is only good for porn. Bunch of the Baylor losers, weirdos. But the porn. Right. Yeah. Goon Squad. Coomers. Goon squad? You know, do you know what a goon cave is? No. Oh my god. Do, do, not, go. do not Google goon cave. Do not. Well, no, they shouldn't because most guys would be like, they'd be kind of nice. It's just like a hundred screens of porn and you're just jerking off for hours. Just wow. milking yourself. <laughs> like like the architect closer. in the Matrix. I don't know. I, like, I, don't know. <laughs> I don't know how I should feel the fact you got closer. As soon as you started talking uh, about porn and goon cave. Just leaking all over the floor. You don't care if your dog licks it up. You're just so horny. He's fascinated. Why? Wait, what? I don't know. I felt like I was watching too much. Okay, so there's uh-huh. a guy There's a guy off the screen right. saying that he's five days uh, clean from porn because he was watching it too much, which is fair. He looks I, like I he agree says with that you. often. <laughs> <laughs> you just look like you say, I've been five days porn free. <laughs> <laughs> he only lasts seven days. 
And then <laughs> and there was Whoa. a point where you were like, this That's is noble. better than God. Uh, yeah, I feel like there's how many up. people did you murder during that 40 <laughs> days? He Easter, he Sunday, up for Lent. Easter Sunday was intense for him. He gave up porn for Lent and oh, Easter Sunday was, was intense. Around? Yeah, right? Oh. <laughs> you don't want your family to watch you jerk off? Come on. Liar. I feel like that's a bold thing to <laughs> give up for down. Lent. That was good. To tell God, yeah, I'm going to give up porn it's for recorded. Lent. We well, he already it's knows. <laughs> he died for our sins. He died for Waluigi hentai porn. <laughs> Technically, that's just fun. That's I'm probably the weirdest for 40 porn days, I've gotten but then into. I'm gonna go back. Like cartoon porn. Like, well, you okay. like hentai? Do you? Well, like, you look like you do, but you don't. I, I, don't, don't I feel like hentai. hentai is like anime porn, but it's literally cartoon what, porn. No, I mean, like that's literally what it is. Yeah, like I can't, uh, I, I, Elastic or like uh, Mrs. Incredible. You know, do Elastic Girl with her tits out could get. <laughs> Yeah. I can't get yeah. into anime uh, or, or hentai porn. It's it, weird. It, I, I mean, also don't like a lot of anime porn. It's just incest porn, like mm. straight up incest porn, which is wild because you could do whatever, and you picked Homer to have sex with Lisa. <laughs> like you would have done all the other characters. You're like, nah, March the and Bart need a fuck so I can get this nut off. You could have drawn it. <laughs> Yeah. You could have drawn you getting laid. <laughs> and and you drew <laughs> incest. There's a saxophone right there. You went with incest. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, what's up? Oh you just you walked in in the perfect the time. I was talking about incest uh, anime porn. No, we're talking well, about it was the Homer. Simpsons. It was Homer Simpson porn. To be uh, fair, it's Homer I don't think that makes it better. <laughs> okay. It's more relatable. Yeah, no, here's a weird one. Public. Have you ever heard of It probably Vore? does make it better. Vore? Just like Vore, V O R E. No. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> you know, so I have two just, conversations <laughs> at the same time. Oh, yeah. What did that mean? We, we got to merge. A sense of humor. <laughs> I'm sure that makes it closer to God a little bit to use. You can just Homer repent and, right when you're about to die, mm -hmm. and it's fine. That is the that is like That's the loophole crazy. of of Christianity. <laughs> yeah, I think there's a saying of, you will be surprised who you see in heaven. Because all you gotta do at the end uh -huh. is go, I repent, sorry. Nancy Reagan. <laughs> Whoever that is. You don't know who Nancy Reagan is? <laughs> nah, but she's like sounds important. The throw goat. Oh, well, I'm gonna look her up. <laughs> <laughs> no, she Wait, was you talking about Lori? No, Nancy That's Reagan. About the queen like that. <laughs> Former queen, dude. Greatest. It's crazy no, yeah, that Larry not. David's wife on Curb Your Enthusiasm, she could be the first lady. And then that's funny to think like Larry David would have had a show where he's like, his wife is <laughs> the first lady. I'm be real, I've never seen it. Uh -huh. yeah, I, I, I've never seen Curb Your Enthusiasm, I'll be honest you with you. You don't like Seinfeld either, I bet. I've seen it back when like I would eat dinner with my parents uh -huh. and they would put on that Jewish yeah. shit. <laughs> you know, my dad, the big <laughs> fat Jew, he's like, this is relatable. Uh -huh. <laughs> I love okay. okay, but uh, a, and they are. Wait, are sometimes, they sometimes I jerk off to Seinfeld. I'm like, every time <laughs> Elaine's on the screen, I'm gonna go extra hard. Do you try and just <laughs> you just pump when she's on <laughs> off stop? No, Dude, there's like she's an episode off, of that Back where. On, off. <laughs> right. Oh yeah, it's like red light, green light. Well, yeah. you don't think Jews like Seinfeld more than regular people? I think they do. That's so weird because there's I an think, episode I, I, where I, she's I they're like, like, look at us go. I feel like Seinfeld mm. is like the Beatles, where I know it's good and <laughs> and I know like the like the cultural impact, but people have done it so much better that I can't really appreciate it or like it. Uh huh. You know what I'm saying? Because I don't really you fuck don't with the Beatles. I don't fuck with Seinfeld. Steam. But I know, but I know the cultural impact and the significance. I know a lot of people copied. Took oh, what they got and I made it better. I wonder what he would be like today as a stand-up. Who Sam Field? Like if he was just. You don't started. have to imagine. He put out a special. No, I'm like, about like if he just started, because I don't think he could be that corny in the. Just starting out, he could well, do that now. Well, I don't now. know because he because his style kind of. You know what I'm saying? Like he was a trendsetter for that style. Right. <laughs> so yeah. without Seinfeld, who knows where we would be with stand-up? Mm -hmm. True that. It's like it's like Richard Pryor, right? He kind of created. What we consider now is like hacking and stuff See, like that, that, but much. without him, we yeah, wouldn't have any of He made it like so very it's... fine yeah. and sharp yeah. and, and like concise. I have no comedy knowledge. I don't Not know. Like, I like yesterday, I was like writing something. I've like never about watched. His Hold on, guys, 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 guys. Please don't over. Please don't over speak over your host. <laughs> no, I was just True. saying that yesterday I was writing something. I was like thinking about like it sounded a little Seinfeldy. I was like, that's a good thing, probably. <laughs> I don't know. Just I was like thinking like. You are a good joke writer. Thank you. But He's like yeah, the joke writer. Actually good to me. It's like his thing. It's like a dying breed to be a jokey joke comedian mm -hmm. instead of a storyteller. I don't think it's a dying breed. I think it is coming back a little bit. Yeah, there are like a handful of like other comics I've seen 
you know, around here. That I don't want to get too political on why. I don't want to get too political on why, but it is coming back. then it used to be more of the majority. It was probably jokey during like Yeah, during like the Obama era, for sure. It was like a lot absurd and jokey joke, which it is coming back. And so we'll see what the next presidential election or what it <laughs> comes back into but yeah, yeah but that's that's as far like i said i don't get too political because i don't <laughs> but yeah uh, but yeah so uh so who's your favorite porn stars ray little black ray little black that's a good one uh, uh if we're going trans daisy taylor <laughs> okay <laughs> you got one on every every team um he I, has a hentai, i've, like, I've liked rachel too. star since i first started rachel on. star she's got big sloppy tits right they're not sloppy they're sloppy they are not i think we're thinking of different people show me he's <laughs> giving <laughs> <laughs> you v- v- violet myers a lot she's great Ooh. never heard of her you know you have they, it what's her name violet myers violet myers violet myers i like the sound of that and gina valentina amazing legends goats nice. hmm. Check them out. You'll you'll appreciate them. You, sh- you should goats. also check them out, man. Do you have a fa- favorite trans? I named a trans. Do you have a favorite trans? I don't know anybody name. What? That I would. I can't get into it. I've what? I've tried. I, I can't really get into it. Have you seen the Andrew Schultz interview with Daisy Taylor? No. Watch it, and you'll be into it. You're like that. Wow, that's a cool girl. Yeah, no, I can't. I'm She's thinking. Not... I can't think of anything. Is that what it? Why did it get weird? Why y'all think you weird over tra- like trans boy? <laughs> yeah. Yo, yeah. I'm trying to get Dane to jerk the off to something. That's why. What? Cool uh, stepmom. <laughs> <laughs> cool. That's your. That's your favorite part. Is <laughs> cool Step- stepmom. <laughs> uh-huh. She's like letting it's, the kids drink and shit uh-huh. when they're not cool. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> I think why don't you guys just stay in? I'll roll us some joints. The cool she just says she's that's, that's hilarious. You type it into the into the search bar. Yeah. Cool step. <laughs> See, that's, that's where she All right, guys. All right, guys. You guys can smoke and drink in the basement, and then after you guys are high, I'll come downstairs and we could all take turns. Y'all watch porn with day. volume on? Yeah. What? Yeah. <laughs> I, f- I feel like I feel it's like, a I feel weird. Like, I feel like I that's part of the fun is the yeah. sound. But the I, audio. I, after I learned that it was fake from an interview with a porn star, their noises, I was like. Well, you, well mm. it took you an interview to realize yeah, that no, it was no, fake. No, I yes, feel like I am a stupid man. I don't know. You know what? That's during why, sex that, makes that, that's it better, why, like, That's why I like like the OnlyFans content more because it is feels more genuine. It's like there's an authenticity. Right, it's like yeah. amateur porn. <laughs> yeah. yeah. That's funny. Obviously, you got it is you act it up. You well, put it up is, a yeah. performance a little bit more, but it is does feel more. But yeah, I can't get into the porn side moan constantly. It's like it cannot be that good. Always constantly. As soon as they come on, bro. I've had no, but like it, it, it actually, thing. like if you actually let yourself moan, it act, it makes everything else feel better because it's like let's try. You're it letting all right everything now. out. <laughs> <laughs> that's all. Yeah, my day. But no, so it's like I mean, it's not necessarily faking it. It's kind of like just letting your body make whatever noises it wants to make. Every podcast so I'm into, I've noticed. <laughs> I, I he, he into this porn. topic. Yeah, I do. I do. <laughs> I don't know why. It's fun. It's fun. I just feel like, because I feel like more men should talk about it and be open and share it. I feel like, don't sure. you feel like a lot of men talk about porn? Yeah. On stage, and yes. I hear about on it a stage, lot. yes. But I don't think, like, in person. Internet and on stage, yeah. But I don't know if they do it in their personal lives. Hmm. Like, I'll to be their honest buddies? with you. Yeah. Yeah, no guys are really like, so what's up with the porn? <laughs> You know so what I'm saying? Like, you guys watch any good porn like, no this weekend? Yeah, like, <laughs> like, no one talks Jared about always like, talk about trans porn. Every, oh, really? <laughs> every single time. That's what I'm saying. Solid. No one opens up about their addictions, their likes, and shit like that. So I guess I'm trying to. Uh, so I'm trying to. Vlad spearhead. has a bit about being addicted to porn. Oh, just me. That's yeah, cool. I'm no, not just, Vlad though. I'm Luis. Let's talk about me, cool. goddamn. Yeah. What are you addicted <laughs> to? Yeah. Huh? What are you addicted to? What am I addicted to? Success. That's a good question. Maybe porn. I'm not sure. I'm Let's addicted to comedy. I'm this. addicted to. I'm addicted to get up on the stage and just crushing it every night. Crushing. <laughs> I'm addicted to that Dude, shit, that man. The, you know, the, the hustle, yeah. the grind, the things most people can't do. <laughs> I'm doing it. I'm addicted to bomb. Because have you guys ever thought about just like quitting stand up? No. Okay. <laughs> Dude, I'm at the point where like if somebody says my name in person, it gives me a tingle. It makes me feel like they're calling my name on stage. I'm so egotistical. That's so if somebody funny. says Mark Harsky, I'm like <laughs> Yeah. Say it louder. Here's your it. order. Here's, Here's your order, please get out. <laughs> yeah, that's why at Starbucks they go with you go Mark Karski. Give me an introduction. I give them an introduction. That's what my whole name is. <laughs> so okay, <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, so this is a question. Well, obviously, this is not for you because you're already in a committed relationship. I don't think you're in a committed relationship. Mm-hmm. Are you in a committed relationship? 
Do so when you guys date, do you guys let the people know that you're that you do stand up on the first date, or do you bring it up, or do you bring it up when they ask? That's the thing. I guess do you introduce it when it's appropriate, or do you just keep it a secret until you got to get to a certain point? I don't try and hide it. You don't um, try to hide it. I feel like that's gonna be talked about before I even see him, right? Like, I, well, I don't think I'd ever be on a date with somebody I haven't talked to, but like if I was on a blind date, I'm definitely bringing it up. Hey, you, I, I go on stage and I do public speaking with jokes. That's so funny. Mm-hmm. But Wait, if I get like a new job, you, you don't use apps? Get, not good at them, dude. I'm just not. Okay, I'm, that's fair. I have a theory Which is about because I feel like you take good pictures. I a, do you put stand up pictures on there? Uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, well, that's, yeah, that kind of. I try to keep away from that. I try um, to keep the like, I've, that's I've, how that's how when they ask us, "What are you doing tonight?" I'm just like hanging out with friends, <laughs> um, hanging out with you'd friends. Br- you'd bring it no. up right away. I feel like it's yeah, yeah, like my, if I were to get a new job, then I'm not gonna tell my coworkers that I'm a comedian. I'm mm-hmm. just gonna let them think I'm funny. Yeah. Because um, I also don't, think I don't it's a cheat code. I also think it's a cheat code because if you bring a date on on a show and stuff like that, nine times out of ten you are gonna hit, especially if you do really well. The first time I met a girl that. The bitch you were talking about before. First time I met her, I bombed in front of her, and I was like, "Oh God, dude!" I was like sweating. I was and like, she still stayed. Oh, she liked you. <laughs> she liked you. That was a good time. Now she's dead. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> R.I.P. Not. I wish. <laughs> she was bad. Yeah. She is the baddie I bombed in front of. I was so sad. Mm. Right. There's a chance she's on dead. to the next. We there's always more baddies. School. There is more baddies. There's an in Toronto, amount. there's so many baddies. Toronto. I love Toronto. Shout out to Toronto. The shows there were great, and the baddies were amazing. <laughs> that, was just, that was just so specific. What kind of show was it? Oh, uh, I did. I did I mean, like. Just the most I did bar flex. shows. I did bar shows. Yo, I did the comedy the bar. I did some club the shows. Fuck, dude. Damn. So, you, how many I shows wish. did you do there? I, I wish I had sex while I was in Toronto. I wish I tried. In Toronto, <laughs> you need a fucking you need goose filled. Their fashion, jackets. their fashion is on point. point. Yeah, dude. Some speak French. Mm, you can't beat a guy speaking French. My, my paint cover jeans wouldn't play there. <laughs> <laughs> no, those would be sick as fuck. No, but the a guy honestly, looks you like you up. and speaks French. Honestly, you lost. I, honestly, yeah. Dan, this would be a good fit. Yeah, yeah. For France, for it's not, your name's not Dan. Fuck, I fucked it up. I'm so sorry. Well, <laughs> Danny, it's fine. That's one of the versions. Danny. You got the majority. It's allowed. People you, in my life call me that. that sh- if he wa- you know, if he wanted yeah. to get pussy today, I'd be like, make it white. white? What would you change his Just name white to? Ex- <laughs> I look at your cock. Big white, expensive. What would do but then I'm. In this was white once, and also I feel <laughs> change like change your name in Toronto is crazy. <laughs> Give yourself a whole other name. White always gets dirty. How good is your French accent? Nice premium tea that just. Hugs your body and I and I rub sunscreen on you when yeah. you're sweating and it so gets kind of in your eye. Sun, but but yeah, Toronto Toronto is a lot of fun. There's a lot of bad. There's a lot I've of cool stuff to do. The food is really good. Really? Yeah. I believe that. Isn't the Toronto a big like <laughs> comedy spot? Like they have a f- comedy festival, right? They no, <laughs> that's Montreal. It's fucking. They're all the same. It's that's fucking, Montreal. That's amazing. Fucking, kind of puts them in a have big you even left the state? And, yeah. Okay. Yeah. You feel like someone that, does, that <laughs> hasn't left their backyard. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it hasn't been that that's often. Like a, so. <laughs> you know, Mark, Mark looks like he has not left the that's state of Illinois. That's a funny way to roast somebody who's asked him a I'll question. Ta- I'll take it, dude. I'll take it. Well, to be fair, it, it feels like you. the only place you probably left is to like go to Florida, I guess. Yeah, I've what's been, the I've most been, exotic place you've been to? <laughs> Oh, none exotic. Florida. <laughs> the place I've been to the most is probably Florida. Hollywood. Is the place <clears throat> that I've Hollywood, the Florida. Most. LA is yeah. dope. Huh? LA is dope. I Once you get past the fact that it sucks. I love. Oh. Dude, I just love like the networking and like everything about Hollywood. I hate so. the networking part of of LA. You're just doing wild. drugs, getting fucked up, <laughs> and that's it, dude. Like I, I was hanging like out with one of David Duke's friends, there. telling him why views shouldn't don't matter, and shit. I was so hammered. And this one guy just bought out this big bag. I thought it was weed that was so big, and I was oh, like, wow. "What is that? What, what else like, would it be? Cocaine. It was cocaine. There was oh, so yeah, much. That's another thing it could be. No, so so while I was in LA. Me and uh, me and St. James are the same James. We we're talking to somebody. Wait, do you guys have you guys been to LA or Hollywood? Okay, let's just keep doing this. Let's just keep doing no, Hollywood oh, no, stories. No, 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 but I was because he was so asking about like, but he was telling me like about it, like having a bad like networking story. So oh, that's why I was like, yes. You guys should pay attention to the host, man. Y'all, I'm I feel horrible, like I feel man. like I'm y'all done co-host. how many episodes now? You guys don't know any etiquette listening. This I'm is fun. Sometimes it is hard to hear 
the, the tone of the voice. Quiet. To be fair, Dan also mumbles. He does. You do yeah. mumble a little bit. And then I feel like Mark's like more like he it's, started this. It's kind of like a church choir, and he's like the bravado or whatever, mm-hmm. or the bass or oh, whoever. Yeah, keeps mm-hmm. showing off. What you else know, do you like, know? I don't even know what bravado means, know. so I'm just saying <laughs> words. Like, but like there's it's different that, that, levels. That sounds about right. There's deep. high and bravado. low and mid, and so I feel like he's the low and we're. I love kinda, alto though. I love like it's alto all singers. Head music harmonious. I did play the clarinet. That's, did you? Oh, man. Yeah, if you were wondering. I do know my music. Because I wanted to play the saxophone. Oh, wow. yeah. I also want to play the saxophone. Dude, the saxophone's cool. Like Lisa Simpson. And that was the prerequisite. But I was like, I'm not. This is gay. Saxophone. You want to play that sax? It's cool as fuck. If I could play Wh- the saxophone. Oh, the clarinet was the prerequisite for yeah. the sax. Dude, if I could whip out a sax right now. It does translate. Yeah. <laughs> just whip it out anywhere. <laughs> a pocket sax. Oh, you know, I just happen to have my saxophone with me, <laughs> oh, you guys. Oops. I could play your favorite song. What oh, is it? I accidentally I brought it to brunch with me. I bring out the motorcycles on my back. I'm like, oops. This old thing. That oh, is, I, I can see well. that. Like, it's just on a strap and it's got some dents and shit in it, but you just fucking you swing it around your shoulder. You're like, yeah, I'm just going to get on my bike and <laughs> at the fucking light. <laughs> like a I place. No I'm like, idea. you know, I might as well. You like you, would, you like, you would play it, you would play it. And they just chuck it, and uh, they just ride off. <laughs> it's experimental. <laughs> Throw it in the hot girl. <laughs> it in the face. Because uh-huh. women don't have reflexes like us. Uh-huh. <laughs> That's right. I've been watching a lot of red pill content. Yeah. <laughs> you love that red pill. Pill. Gonna... <laughs> That's so your YouTube serious. fan base. <laughs> I'm so serious. Yeah, have you guys heard of Zerka? No, no, we're not doing this. We're not doing this. We're not doing this. We're not doing this. We're not. We're not doing it. So anyway, uh, what other type? What, what other is. things do we have on the docket? Luis is right. What yeah. other things do we have on the docket? Oh, okay. Bro, bro, because I worked so hard to avoid that. Just <laughs> for just be, for me, yeah. 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 <laughs> I missed that whole 2016 like YouTube like con- like pipeline to like. All oh, right, I'm good. I'm mm-hmm. not. I'm not going back. <laughs> I, I, like I avoided that, and now I'm kind of, you know, I, I'm avoiding that. Mark knows, but he watches it just to for entertainment. Yeah, that's why. But then he also questions. I'm, I'm also kind of like, he believes in that shit somewhat. <laughs> no, Mark believes in that. When shit When they make somewhat. a whore look dumb, I'm like, <laughs> hell yeah, Zerka. <laughs> so you got de- that deep into the, the sex- red pill the, content. The, the, the no sexual too. tension is back. We're we're cooking. <laughs> we're cooking. <laughs> Oh, but yes, no, I, tr- I tried to bring this up earlier. It it's going back to sexual things, but there's a kink that uh, one of my <laughs> friends one of my friends was telling me he's into. I'm not going to divulge. You would know him anyway. Yeah, say his but, full uh, name. No, it's okay. Uh, I'll it's called it It's called Vore. It's, it's spelled V-O-R-E. Okay, what is it? And it's like this upset. Th- it's, like, it's like you want to be consumed, like, entirely. By like, what? Like, your whole body. <laughs> By what? Like a snake. But, like, well, that's kind of like the tentacle porn, similar to that. Oh, like, so it's like monsters hentai. and like I guess oh, when he okay. watched Men in Black, you know, when they the got porn, swallowed whole by the bugs. Would the know? quicksand porn technically fall into vor? Maybe. I yeah, I didn't look There's too much into it, porn? but like. I just oh, I yeah, thought it was time. interesting. I, was, you know? I, I, was, like, I was like, I like I was actually okay. thinking like no, quicksand. I know quicksand. No, 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 I'm serious. Girls literally just fall in quicksand slowly naked. Mark's I didn't see like, it. Somebody talks about it on stage here. I forget who. Yeah, but they talk mm-hmm. about it, and I've watched. But, well, yeah. hold on. Is it Vlad? <laughs> no, he talks <laughs> about his porn addiction, though. It's a good time. Uh, he He's he's uh, the right size to be stuffed up a gigantic <laughs> being, oh, inside right? Inside me, yeah. Or like, uh, wh- dude, where's my car? Remember that one? No. <laughs> <laughs> At the I end of the movie, the the hot alien Call girls they, like the right morph size into a giant one. And you're like, crazy. where's the sunset? Of the <laughs> yeah, right size for more porn. Here's my car. <laughs> You'd be Cinema great test. at this. <laughs> you have a future yeah. kid. We'd save so Thinking much on production remember with the you. Line. I don't know where you win. Think about it. The contraptions no have to be half the size for Vlad. Back. So what are you guys talking about? Wait, did you? When did you start comedy? Uh, did we all start at the shrine together around the same time? No. no. Ten? No, 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 no. I started February. Technically, I started when I was 16 February. years old. Um, I think I started at LOL or at Second City. Oh, okay. I took a class at Second City. Actually. No, I, it was not even a class. Yeah, like back on Sunday so did, mornings, like, uh, mic they had a mic on Sunday yeah. mornings, and my dad drove me there, and it was cool. Nice, nice. Second City's kind of cool. Little gay. Wait, what? It's a little gay. What? Second City? Yeah. Okay, I'm not. That's the first place I saw transgender bathrooms. I'm like, all bathrooms are for both genders. All all of them. Right, I feel like whenever. Literally every bathroom on earth is both. 
seriously, like toilet. if it, yeah, if it's an individual <laughs> bathroom it with a was. toilet, there's uh, there's, there's no reason to, like what, because women are gonna no be urinal. cleaner or something, like, I, and I think I feel like. Women are actually, the bathrooms are actually worse than a man's bathroom. Have you seen this one compa compared to the one that we have? Compare women's these. bathrooms no, are kind of nasty gone in the women's sometimes. bathroom. Women's but. bathrooms are kind of nasty sometimes. Yeah, we have to clean yeah. the camera. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, they, they have to clean the camera. Why is there a that's camera what, in the bathroom? That's what I'm saying. You have to go in there and clean. And they, yeah, they do more stuff in the bathroom, you know? Like in the, and the mirror and is like there's just more to be their, done. Is that where they do their more periods? More mess to be made. They do, do they do they do the, they do their periods in there yeah isn't that gross is that where those happen I mean that's where you gotta like have it like they do if you're gonna have a period have it in the bathroom <laughs> what, what do, they, what the do women do in the bathroom they have their periods was it the Egyptians oh. was what? it the who invented the periods the Egyptians <laughs> <laughs> was it the uh, Egyptians the aliens every time uh, a girl has a period she gotta pay Jews. royalties to the uh huh <laughs> It's sad. <laughs> it's before we end this, beautiful Luis. structures. We have no idea how. Guys, before we end this, we got we got like five minutes left. I need to ask, why do you think they're telling us about aliens? <laughs> just do you think don't, it's you a lie? Even, Are they covering something up? Epstein. It's, a, it's like an okay. How much? Where's that list? We get. You're gonna keep lying. Can to I us. say something real? Aliens. No. Real. If it's about aliens, yes. <laughs> All this is I don't think they have, have to now. distract us with anything. We don't pay attention. You're right. We don't pay attention. I hate that whole all oh, they do, bro. They do all this shit in front and center, and no yeah, one pays like attention to their cares. Yeah, like they don't have to hide anything. The <laughs> they just do yeah, like total bullshit all the time. Yeah. Yeah, they don't. Even like, what do you think either. the G20 World <laughs> Summit is? <laughs> <laughs> they just no, like so do bullshit what do you, what do you think all the about time. The aliens? Do you think that we we uh we just don't fight back did you, at did all. Did you watch the congressional hearing? That dude was so full of bullshit. I'm, the I'm whistleblower? sorry. Whistleblower? Yeah. Whistleblower? Yeah. That dude was so full of bullshit. I don't believe yeah. me. I do believe they exist. I, here's the thing. I don't know. I don't believe they exist, but I don't don't believe that they exist. I feel like to just shut that they don't exist or like any spirits or stuff like that is dumb because so the world is so weird and complicated. I don't know. Oh, like 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 they're walking among us? No, no. Okay. I mean, probably. Honestly, probably. But realistically, no. I feel like, like they have all one captured. Bulgarians are aliens. <laughs> the all who? They kind of look like <laughs> aliens. <laughs> I said hey, aliens are Bulgarian. I, I My can't lawyer they might didn't. agree. Yeah, you know what? Then I'm wrong because I feel like if they were aliens, they'd be extra intuitive and they would know. Maybe they're just so intellectually above us that they could talk and listen at the same time. Oh, they're like, yeah, that's <laughs> that's pretty next level shit. And they're right also there. having like mind wave conversations. But I don't yeah. know. I, I like I like. There's so much other shit to take it to like care about and learn on that I don't yeah, give a fuck the, about aliens. The UFO, I feel like dude, aliens is like aliens, some fake pseudo but if there's an invasion, intelligence shit if there's an invasion, to pay I'm to. not paying taxes. It's, I'm stealing. You're not paying taxes now. Shh. <laughs> I'm trying to make it seem like I I would stop. I would also steal. <laughs> aliens. Steal. What? You think the fucking you're gonna pull people over for speeding when there's an alien mothership? We'd have to unite <laughs> against the aliens, obviously. No. <laughs> Maybe this is to unite the world. Dude, that's why they want to make a one-world government and have a fake alien invasion. Thank you so much and for I'm watching the Drex Podcast. Wow. I've been uh, Mark Arsty. <laughs> What's your name? Danny Hamill. Danny okay. Mahler. Luis <laughs> Follow your me balls, on Trump? TikTok, <laughs> Instagram, uh, YouTube, and, and Pornhub. And home. A Humble Luis. A Humble L-U-I-S. We love you. Thank you so much for coming on. Thank you for having me. I don't think I'll be back. <laughs> <laughs>